Hello guys and welcome back to the Teardown and Stuff channel. So today we're playing a new one for the channel, Bendy and the Dark Revival. Now, this was meant to be a Halloween special, but as you got us you smart people in the audience are probably like, Jake, it's like well it's like as I'm recording, it's like five days after Halloween. I know, I know, it's a late Halloween special. But you know what? We're we'll going easy. Um and yeah, so late Halloween special. Also want to say on oh, I don't remember this cutscene, no. If it wasn't I played this game, I'm gonna be honest. Um We're always free to choose. No, can you shush shut to believe up? What I want, want to, to believe. Hang on, my flipping But when you step back can I when you really look at where can you you've been. Shut up. Can you actually shut the up? Things you've can done. you actually shut up? This is my video. Can you shut up? My video, not your video. Your past will come. Bruh, this is so scary in heaven mode. It feels like the bloody um to devour you. Um <laughs> there's actually someone banging on the door back there. Like, I don't, I'm not wearing headphones currently, but I remember when wearing headphones, it generally sounded like banging on the door. But anyway, like I was saying, my betting over it video, I will, it's coming soon, I promise, I'll like, record it sometime. Yeah, because I haven't even recorded it. That's how bloody that I am. But yeah, it's been ages since I've played this game. Um, yeah, also, maybe. Well, I, was, I remember I bought it like the day it came out, so. More frames to go. No way I'm getting through tonight without some coffee. Probably some downstairs. Right. So for a little adventure. So bro, this, this game runs like crap on this computer, but Oh my god, it, it does. It really does. It really does lag like Oh my god, bro. <laughs> this game is so bad on this. Bro, can, like, I turn down the bloody graphics. It's on low. <laughs> well, first of all, I need to adjust this, but, bruh. This game is actually runs like absolute crap. Right, open the door. Open the door, thank you. I'm hoping it's just this section, right? Okay. It's a horror game, so there are jump scares like that. So, quick warning for people who are scared of jump scares. Don't watch the video if you don't like jump scares, you know? Right? <laughs> you heard it here first. If you don't like jump scares and don't watch the video, if you watch the video and, like, get scared by the jump scares, it's not my fault, okay? I, I, I'm warning really? you now. They locked me in. Good thing I brought my own key today. Oh, bro, now, I hate this section, because it's like, I remember it when I first bought the game, it's like, you got to backtrack, and then you got to go back, I think, again. Who put this here? Bro, it's literally bendy me, demon. Hello there, mate. Anyway, we to go back. Um, all I remember about this game is its sequel to bendy the machine. Whew. Here's the key. Why didn't you... My question is, why do you take the key in the first place? Like, surely if you were kind of expecting, or if there was even the slightest possibility of you getting locked in. Now, what's kind of scary for me, I don't remember when the bloody jump scares are, so I will probably end up um, getting scared out of my frickin' mind. Not the most welcoming hallway I've ever seen. Nah, it is, mate. What, what do you mean? What, seeing a moth and brute? Oh, yeah, I remember the bloke, you see. Yeah, Hello? so I'll try not to spoil it. Is someone it. there? I don't even know who we're playing as because the bloody subtitles are cut off. Call the elevator. I remember this bit. I remember this bit. I think it's a jump scare, isn't it? I think it's a jump scare with, um... Why the man missed the legend? Audrey, that's his name. That's her name. It's literally Ernst Stavro Blofeld, though, guys. It literally does look like Ernst Stavro Blofeld, though. Just taller, 
didn't mean to and, frighten you. Um, You're working late tonight. A um, pretty girl like And there's a scar in the... Well, he's not bald, actually, so I guess he isn't completely all blown by yourself. I remember when I saw this guy, I was like, what the hell? This guy is a villain. He looks like Flippin. Uh, 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 Stavro. Not. Uh, Thank you. Audrey. You look like you could use a little <laughs> company. God, this man. You can see her huddling up in the corner. She's like... <laughs> so, it's been really nice this past week. Just beautiful. This man is like literally speaking like Blofeld as well. Like with a deep voice and uh, <laughs> like a, a, a lisp. What was that? I love how calm he is. Don't you worry, my dear. It's this man just is so a little crazy. short in this system. Happening a lot these past few days. No need to fret. I play again. I'm Let's generally see scared. What we can find. Now, sorry if I'm not talking Come as much, along cause... now. Old Wilson will protect you. I highly doubt that. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I might not be talking as much because I like generally want to listen into what's going on. Because, like I said, it's been like over a year since I played this game last. Um, I actually uninstalled it, so I had to reinstall it just for this video. So I hope you guys are happy. And I guess this video. Uh, I guess um I might do another video. Wait, do I have to talk to him? Uh, I remember this was the biggest shock of the game for me. It was so oh. Oh, God, I hate this game. I honestly it will be like bending the ink machine is scary, but it's not as scary as this game. Like like now nah, this game is actually so scary. Like, bruh, like. So this is the biggest surprise to me. Joey Drew is dead. 1961 to 1970. Oh, I don't remember what that says. Like, cause like, like I said, um, uh, this game runs like absolute crap on my um, on my computer. So yeah, I can't read what anything says. But uh, yeah, in terms of the graphics. But yeah, that was the biggest shock of the game is that he's dead. But yeah, it's like. I quite like this, the museum. It's like, let me in. Let me, let me in. Bro, bro, can you let me in? Thank you. Thank you. Now, this already looks kind of sus if you play Bendy in the Ink Machine. Which, that's like one of my favourite horror games, so. <laughs> Don't be talking smack about Bendy in the Ink Machine in the comments, or I will. Not looks like that. someone's been messing with the exhibits. There should be something <laughs> Did you see that guy's expression for a second there? <laughs> it was like... Sweet oh, I can't even make the face. Like, oh, this guy Do an old man a favor and, and go find him. him. God. <laughs> Every time I see him, he just looks like Blofeld. That, that's, that's, that's it. He's just taller. It's just Blofeld is... I think every single Blofeld... Actually, Blofeld's been under 5 foot 6. <laughs> That's a bit of a fun fact for you. Actually, I have no clue. I haven't fact checked that. I probably have to. Um, book, yeah. I don't know, but I know Blofeld are very short in the books as well, so I don't know. Believe that's the Ted Allen stuff facts for you guys. Um, this. Oh, thank you. Like, I mean, like, what I like is this is like the exact mimic of what happens in Bendy the Ink Machine Chapter 1. Though, it pretty much is. Though, isn't it? Is it not, like, basically the same as Bendy the Ink Machine Chapter 1? You start, you go, um, into this room, and you find all these damn pedestals, and you're like, hmm, let me put this stuff on it. Bro, I've already been recording for almost 10 minutes. How? Bro, how have I almost been recording for ten minutes? Bro, it's <laughs> sorry. I sound really surprised, but I am. It's like, bro, it's like. Now the scary thing about horror games is I can't stop just looking behind me constantly. Like, you know when Bendy is just gonna be up. 
Right, I'm about to stop the video because I was planning for a quick 15 minute video, but this is going to be like a 30 minute video if it carries on at this pace. Oh, wait, hang on. Have I got this one as well? Have I got them all? I don't think I've got the ink. Well, yeah, how about. No, I haven't got the cog either. But where's Wilson? Oh, he's, he's right here. He's doing some stuff, for right? Yeah, I mean, it must me, it was no surprise Wilson was the baddie. I mean, like, it would have been a bit better, in my opinion. Yo, I literally just saw, I saw someone behind me, um... This is generally, like, scary. Okay, well, yeah, like, it would have been better... ...if he... ...was... ...wasn't, sorry, the villain, and he was, like, a little... That's what I thought they were gonna do. I thought they were gonna do something creative, you know? Oh, wait. So where is the cog there? Because I don't remember this, but I remember in the real game, or the sort of Bendy the Ink Machine game, the cog was like... I don't bloody remember, it's been ages since I played that game as well. Oh, here. Well, obviously, where it says cog. Bro, I probably might have to, like, stop this soon, because, like, bro, I've been recording for, like, ten minutes already. Like, now, bro. Like, how? Not even done with the bloody, with the bleeding tutorial section of the game yet. Like, bro, how have I not even finished the tutorial section of the game? And it's almost been, it's been over the years. There we go. And my man is finished. I don't stab Red Blover. Oh, sorry, I mean, Janitor Wilson Only is finished. Only one thing left to do. Pull that switch. Okay. Why can't you do it, mate? Fricker. It is done. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, our dreams. Oh, the things you've set in motion. What's happening? The ink is calling us, my dear. No joke, I'm just going to go check my back. I guess what? enjoy the cutscene, guys. Enjoy the cutscene. Don't fret. We're going home. Stay back. Listen to me, Audrey. To these last words, because very soon you will forget everything. Let me go. Come find me, on Come find me. I hate this cutscene so much. By the way, I generally, <laughs> I generally I have gone and turned on the light in my room because <laughs> I had it off. Let's get people. It's relatively light outside. Um, but then, so, turn it back on. What are you doing? Oh, the no. man is like, no. that's how you're meant to die. That, that's, that's how you meant to die. That's how you die. It's, my man just gave the tutorial for how to die. <laughs> like, if you think, oh yeah, Ted on stuff is such a wimp, he doesn't know how to, he can't even stand this stupid horror game. You try playing this horror game. This game is scary, like, even just the atmosphere of this game is scary. Oh god. Oh my god, I, I just honestly hate this. <laughs> like, bruh. You better not be commenting on how much of a wimp I am, but nah. I, I do like myself a bit of horror game, as you know, with my five minutes of threatening this gameplay. Wilson, no. I've been beaten this game, by the way, guys. <laughs> That's the other thing. What's wrong with me? Oh, Audrey. What's happened to you? So, there's a lot of theories on what happened here. My personal one is that she got washed away to a different part of the studio. And... She's in like a different part of the studio now, but she, but just she's got this like weird ink or cartoony, oh, and it's like this inky and cartoony, um, I really, I mean like, I get there are tape recordings in this game, but there, there's also notes, which I, I, I don't think is very good, I don't like reading, like, who likes reading? 
Of course, I'm kidding. I like reading. Okay, guys. I'm not stupid. But the first few levels are quite slow, though, to be honest. That's probably why it's taken me almost 15 minutes. Right, I might have to extend my time for this video, guys, because it's, it's been over 15 minutes. Over, over. Ready? There we go. Right, now do the thing so I can go up the thing. Play Golden Eye. I know this works. I must admit, the way this game is set out, it does remind me of Golden Eye. Right? You, you can just pause if you want to read the notes. Oh, seat crouch. Thank you. Right, I really like doing like the atmosphere. Either bending the machine. Okay. Oh, Sammy Lawrence. Favorite character. <laughs> I can't even see the subtitles. I don't even hear the rest of it. I need a moment. I need a moment. That that really got me. I might not have screamed, but I'm not the sort. Of, I'm actually not the sort of person to scream at a jump scare. I'm more just. Oh my god, sort of thing, you know. So oh, two seconds later, I'm gonna scream at a jump scare. But honestly, a corpse coming from the ceiling like that, bro, like, you can't. I am definitely scared, but oh, here we go. I just received the call. Joey Drew is dead. Quiet into an extraordinary life. Last I heard, he was staying in some cramped apartment downtown. You practically hear the rats through the telephone when he called me last April. In spite of that, old Joey sounded quite happy when last we spoke. More like the excited, hopeful young man I knew once upon a time. <sighs> well, farewell, my friend. What will become of your creations now? Oh wait, uh, what was that thing? What was that thing? I barely remember anything about the game. Bro, where did he go? Oh god, it's lagging, it's lagging. Bro, why am I lagging? I remember I saw this meme where it was like... POV in horror games when it tells you where that you have to run, right? I think I might have to call the video off here, um... I love this though. I love it to see old theme as well. I think this game's really fun actually. But I'll end off the video here because I'm already freaking out and it's not even like past chapter one yet. So I'll end the video looking at the Heavenly Toys sign. Goodbye.